difficult match to watch. If you could have any mid laner in the world to go against Faker, would it be? Would this it be man? Faker or would it be BDD? Oh, you meant against Zoe, Faker, which yeah. for now has been a very Zoe favored matchup from what we've seen. Once she can poke you from far away after hitting six. I'll hold the thought because Peanut is down here. He doesn't have his flash. We got a Shen coming on in. This might be first blood. Oh, we might dupe them. We got an Ignite coming in though and a uh, flash rather. Not a big fan of the pick myself. I'll hold that thought. We have a fight here. Looks like Beyond is going to get caught. He's got Shen for help for the shield, but it's going to be a little bit too late. He throws a minion at you and does damage. Want to see this replay? This time, BDD just wanted to kill. It was Gorilla there. Peanut jumps over the wall. Easy peasy had his flash also to confirm the kill. Only picks left over. Uh, Ian in a bit of trouble here. Does have his flash available. And actually turns it around. He's got Shen on top of him. Forced to use that stopwatch, but that gets him into so much trouble. Running into three people now. Max is all alone. He got a stopwatch, but it doesn't help in this situation. I will eat my words. It's actually. Oh! He almost does go down towards the Rascal end. back, but Ian getting caught. Max almost dying means that this mid lane is going to be pushed. Although he does get the peanut here. And now Baha making his way into the mid lane. Everyone's Got another golden. stopwatch in this game. Now Beyond is going to get knocked down. As nobody on MVP can seemingly uh -oh. do anything. But finally, Peanut gets taken out. 1-3-0 before now. Hold on to that point as BDD walks up to Ian. And you think, OK, he takes the trouble bubble wide as he cleans. Ian baits himself in, and then BD is like, uh, you know, I'm Azir with Nashor's Tooth. I'm ready to go. Team is in position as well. Great bait coming through from BDD. Turn on to Max, who's going to live on the start of all of this. It's to flash away. Doesn't die from all these shenanigans. But we had more action after this. But Zoe is just too strong. Seems like that is not the truth at this point in time. Gorilla is going to be taunted up, but he has a lot of help from his teammates. Prey just doing free damage on the right side with Peanut on the left. Down will go Max as they just run into this one. And now Jarvan is going to be stunned up. Nowhere for him to go. He's going to catalyst, but Baja wants no play in this. He might be forced into it, though, as here comes BDD. Going to try to slow him down. Looks like he might get away. This time it's all been about the four members you see on the screen. They want a Baron. They're gonna go for it, and they got Callista and a Mountain Drake, so they have an opportunity. Ian misses his Paddle Star. Now taking a ton of damage on the backside of this. Max is gonna be slowed down by Prey, but really just using that to get out of dodge here. BDD will eat a death for this play in the end of it all. Looks like Gorilla will as well. Yeah, he's really been good. doing his job. The rest of the team, not so much. TP comes in, and looks like ADD is coming in as well. Uh, and now Shen is... Uh, TPing onto Beyond, but it might be a little bit too early here as he does go down. And Braum nearly dying in the process. Meanwhile, but Rascal is just happily pushing bot. There's no real answer for him. A lot of wins to pick up against teams that are getting better. As, all right, Sion really wants to get involved. He's got a good opportunity here with the help of Zoe, which will definitely cut back on some of this damage from the ultimate of Rascal. Really wants to take out ADD, though. He's still got an opportunity here with the stop box. Meanwhile, we got a Baron. Attempt coming in. That's going to be smited down by Peanut, who is getting a little bit low in the background, but Beyond is just not tanky enough to deal with this. Way too far behind. Of course, the death timers are not that severe. Another pick, though. Maha's taking red, which seems really risky when BDD's going to kill him. Hey, you were talking about aggressive positioning. It's about as aggressive as it gets. Peanut going to come in and try to steal the kill, but BDD says no. Go back to your jungle. Will be another inhibitor going down. Looks like they want to end this game. Making a push for it at the moment. BD's full health. He still has his ultimate and didn't feel enough threat to use it. Ian still dangerous for some of the members. We got a TP coming in. They want to end this now. Prey moving forward. He is just chopping away at the top and block. Anyone who's in front of him, they take out Max. Ian getting low. Rascal in the front, just zoning everybody out. Not much that ADD can do at the moment. Maybe he can get a kill. Finally does in the end. Looks like Beyond actually stole that one. But he is going to pay for it here as ADD's ghost, the zombie uh, Zion, can't even take him out. Ezreal respawning here. Trying to get a couple more kills on the backside of this, but that's going to be the second Nexus turret going down. BDD wants another kill. They pay for it, and he does get taken out <laughs> before the end, and that's going to be the win for King Zone Dragon X. And for those watching at home, Rossel got a couple of kill involvements at the end, so will not end 0-1-0. The TP 
to get something to help him out on the scoreboard. It was nothing about Rascal, it was all about the other four members. And BDD, your mid lane prodigy, was the superstar in this game. Azir versus Zoe has been a losing matchup for Crown. Losing matchup in multiple series, not a losing matchup for that of BDD. He had some backup from Gorilla and also his jungler Peanut. But his mechanics and his ability to suck in Ian, who got too keen, thought he could get a kill, thought he could make something happen. He could not. MVP's streak of losses continues up to seven after this game and definitely looking like it could be a short night and 8-0 lights out for MVP. The real question for me is, do you sub in Khan now? <laughs> no. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Just yeah, give him another shot to show off, perhaps. Do you sub in Cuz now is another interesting question here. For that, this side that makes a lot more sense. Of King's Own Dragon X. For now, yeah. we can't see him in the booth.